Anlin took out the jade pendant left by her mother, and claimed she was the emperor's daughter, just as they were about to reunite. Minister Wei stepped in, saying this wasn't something a single token could prove, only a blood test could confirm the truth. So in front of all the officials, the emperor dropped his blood into a bowl that held Anlin's blood. After a moment, the royal physician declared their blood didn't match. The court erupted in chaos. This was treason deceiving the emperor. The emperor questioned Anlin about the jade. She insisted it was from her mother. Then he suspicion turned to the general who brought her here. The crown prince quickly urged Yun Yi to step in. Otherwise, Anlin would be doomed. The modern guy Yun Yi criticized the royal physician, saying blood tests weren't a reliable way to prove kinship. This shocked everyone. How dare a young man question the court physician? Things were spiraling out of control. So the emperor ordered everyone to stand down. Then General Qin Xiong spoke up in Yun Yi's defense. The physician said ancient texts claimed family blood always merges, and mocked Qin Xiong for being a warrior with no medical knowledge. Other ministers fanned the flames, accusing Qin Xiong of challenging imperial authority. Under their harsh words, Qin Xiong suddenly coughed up blood and collapsed. Yun Yi grabbed another bowl, collected Qin Xiong's blood, then added his son's blood. They were true father and son, but their blood still didn't merge. This left the ministers speechless, proving the test was flawed. Then Yun Yi used a transfusion, passing the son's blood to Qin Xiong. He explained, human blood comes in four types. If blood types don't match, a transfusion could be deadly. The ministers finally understood. The emperor immediately ordered the royal physician executed, blaming him for relying blindly on old books and nearly ruining the royal family. Qin Xiong pleaded for mercy, saying the physician was tied to scholars in Shandong. Killing him might cause unrest. The emperor grew angrier. How dare anyone tell me how to rule? And ordered the physician sent to prison for execution at a later date.